Hello and welcome back to Leeds Student Television. You're watching Leeds Student Television. Welcome to LSTV. You're watching Leeds Student Television. Welcome back to Leeds Student Television. You're watching Leeds Student Television. Welcome back to LSTV. It's Freshers Week. So we're going to chat to some freshers. Let's go. I'm joined by Emily Rudge, captain of the England Women's Rugby League team. We're looking forward to the game tomorrow against New Zealand and excited for a bit of a challenge. Honestly, it's literally like a dream come true. Like I wanted to represent Canada however I can. This is James Woodburn Hall, half of Jamaica, playing in the Rugby League World Cup. George, are you excited for the Christie's Cup? Hello and welcome to LSTV's coverage of the Christie Championships. at Headingley Stadium for the Rugby Final of Varsity 2022. Oh, but still from Ooh. Union of Leeds. Wonderfully intercepted there. Running the pitch. <laughs> Will anyone catch her? And Dal says Potential she goes and 11. scores no, by the post over. for the first points of the Varsity game. Congratulations, you've just won. coming to you live for Freshers 2022. I'm here in the Riley Smith Theatre to see some of the societies that are out today at the Freshers Fair. I mean, it's clear that Ella is now reaching new heights in her broadcasting career. We are actually coming to you live from the iconic Wavy Bacon on campus, but we also have some other teams around the rest of campus. This live show is all in the aid of charity. Texting give five, give 10 or give 20 to 70766. Now, as we know, Haley and Holly have been around campus collecting donations. Give me all of your love, everything just... And the current total is... £220. Yes, get in there. You've been watching the hustings for Lead LUU 2023 on Ellis TV. Education never came easy to me. Education is really difficult um, and that's what we need to prioritise. And today I have referred myself to the university's counselling service. It's almost a box ticking exercise for the university. No signposted support for mental health at all. The lay party's policy on student finances, you know, we should have means test maintenance grants and we should scrap tuition fees. Today we're on campus to find out what our students think of Liz Truss's resignation. There should have been a general election. Will you be watching the World Cup this year? No. Why not? Because boycott Qatar. I'm Alison Phillips, I'm the editor of The Mirror um, and I'm also the chair of Women in Journalism. How come you wanted to get involved with the Women in Journalism scheme? To support women in, in journalism so they can reach whatever, whatever they want to do in journalism, they should feel there's no barrier to it. But here at LSTV we wanted to find out what the protests were like on the ground. Any change in society, you always disrupt the lives of people. Uh, unfortunately, yeah, these people are being affected today. So what are we supposed to do? What are these people supposed to do? They're heroes. I was just wondering what your reaction is to the 125-page report into anti-Semitism within the NUS. Look, I think that report was a difficult read uh, for me, for many Jewish students, for lots of activists who've given you know, years of their life to NUS. Sadly, it very much was, was to be expected. It chimes with what we've been hearing for many years. My name's Amelia and you're watching Lead Student Television. We are partnering with the UniBoob Leads team. We're going to go ask students around campus if they know how to check their chest. Today I'm here with Rabbi Dana. We have created our community down here on campus. We are here at Leeds Light Night, which takes place right here in the Leeds city centre. This weekend, the City of Leeds got to celebrate Pride for the first time since 2019. Today, I'm going to be showing you some of the lovely festive decorations that we have on campus. We 
have paired up with Goose and Gander to bring you the Leeds 101 series. One of the great things about Leeds is it has loads of live music. Now a large part of the Leeds culture is about sustainable fashion. We are taking you around some of the best places to eat and drink in Leeds. We've given you seven things to put on your Leeds student bucket list. and we are here at Leeds Festival 2022. Hot as ball sack. <laughs> Download Festival 2022. At Slam Dunk 2022. Live at Leeds in the City 2022. Welcome to Lee Student Television's coverage of Part Life 2022. I need to make a pact with the devil. Hand me down jewels and your dirty blonde hair. I think you're so cool and different and then the law pulls up and you won't get in the car. And I'm like, oh god damn, not another rock star. And we're here outside Fruity to chat to all the freshers about how they're looking forward to Fruity's 21st birthday. Five a day keeps the doctors away. Hey, let's go! <laughs> Woo! Woo! <laughs> Are you excited for your first grad? I'm really excited. I've heard lots about the sausage rolls. Yeah, it's been good. Give it a six out of 10. Unfortunately, this one gets a two out of ten. Did you even go to the UK if you didn't go to Greg's? We're getting our new members to guess our current members' degrees. I'm already going to assign you journalism because you give me journalism vibes. How do you feel about the state of politics? I can already <laughs> tell these are wrong. Today, we're going to be taken to two different locations around Leeds with the goal of finding one another. The first person took a photo of the other and sent it in the group chat with. I'm on the alleyway but behind a bin. You're behind a bin? Glamorous. Got him, got him, he's there. No! Yesterday, Spotify Wrapped came out. So we asked some of our members who their top artists were, their top five, and we're going to try and guess whose was whose. We've been sent some questions from down under, more specifically, the University of Wollongong. What could their mascot be? Baxter, so, the Capybara. No, we didn't do too well. Well, I don't think we've done our country proud today. Where is Spanker Nog? <laughs> I want to go. 